We all want our kids to have the best education possible. To do that, state leaders are throwing their support behind several bills, including one that would assign letter grades to schools based on their performance. But as KXAN's Phil Prazen shows us, some people say the idea could do more harm than good. Many conservative lawmakers campaigned on taking Texas towards school choice. Education chair Larry Taylor laid out what he calls step one in education reform. They've got a lot of good schools and they've got some schools that frankly aren't getting the job done. One of the bills would grade individual schools, giving them a grade of A through F and advertising it to the public. Texas already does this on a district level, but now it only says if a campus has met state standards. This will help highlight those campuses and put pressure, frankly, from the parents and for the district to do something about those campuses. The idea of grading for schools came through the session last time but failed. We don't really think that they are great bills now either. Monty Exter from the Association of Texas Professional Educators is worried that this is a way to shame parents into private schools. And we had a burning building and instead of going in and trying to put the fire out, we stood off to the side and insulted the building and then we only sent folks in to randomly pull out about 5 to 10 percent of the folks in the building. Students would no doubt love to grade their teachers once in a while, but after this session, the state could be grading the school. Phil Prazen, KXAN News. Well, senators laid out other bill ideas, including a parent empowerment bill, which would let parents play a role in decision making for their school if it's deemed failing for two years.